guys, it's Woody Mark here, come brand new squad builder video, and to begin with, hopefully I haven't forgotten the intro or anything, but yeah, um, Simba, who's on my Minecraft channel, made me an intro, so thank you to him, and yeah, without further ado, let's get into it. So, in goal, we've got Michel Vorm, and personally, rated advice Vorm, he wasn't a bad keeper per se, he made some pretty okay saves, but at times he sort of blocks a few shots. I guess for 700 coins he isn't too bad. Right back we got Coleman, pretty solid, not as good as last year, I think personally, but yeah, he's still a pretty good signing. Centre backs we got Van Dyke and Smalling, Smalling absolute tank, Dyke is good, but I don't think he's as good as Smalling. Smalling, you can notice he's a complete beast. Dyke could have been a little bit better. Left back, we got Baba, and Baba just went down that left hand side. Probably one of the best aggressive left backs I've used so far. He was quite good, actually. Centre mids, we got Blind and Herrera, and personally, they're both good on the ball. Blind got a few tackles in, but replaced them both. Like, they're, they're not that great. Just replace them immediately with someone else. But again, this is about trying out players. Cam, we got Barkley, and yeah, Barkley was quite good. He, like, scored one goal, pretty good goal. Assisted two. Yeah, he did, he did alright. I would still advise signing him. Right wing, we got Lamella, and yeah, Lamella wasn't too great either. But to be fair, the left and, well, the wingers in this game don't seem to score goals. And you don't get to, and you don't tend to score many goals in this game either. Left, well, we'll go left wing. We got Gradle, Gradle, left wing. Again, was pretty good. Like could have done better, but again, you don't tend to score many goals. And the last player we've got is Duke. Granted, for one game, I accidentally had my squad like that, but nevertheless, Duke. I don't know. I, I guess it's his 68 dribbling that really lets him down because. When using someone like Rodrigo, he's got high dribbling, so it sort of makes it easier. However, that is the side. Um, if you guys are wondering, player instructions are the same, and team instructions are the same. Are there team instructions? I don't know, can't be bothered to look at it. But nevertheless, we're going to go into the goals and view part at the end. Now that you've seen the goals went into the main review part of the video, and this side cost 26k, so it is quite a cheap squad builder. Had a record of one win, two draws, and two defeats, and yeah, to be honest, in this game, personally, I would, well, I'm going to talk about it more in another video, but just doesn't break the shooting mechanics, because yeah, only scoring five goals with a team like this just doesn't happen. Goals against five, and again, only conceded five goals. The squad builder wasn't that good. I should be conceding more than that. <laughs> Best player was Chris Smalling, however, ironically. Like, he, he was just a tank. He made the defence good. Worst player was Herrera. He didn't really do too much, to be perfectly honest. Top assist man was Barkley with two assists. He did quite well. One of the best players in the side. Top goal scorer was many on one. So I could argue do maybe Lamella. Lamella didn't do that well either. And we made one guy rage quit, so we may would have scored more goals, to be fair. The only win we had was a guy rage quitting. Could have scored more goals. However, this is the lowest rating I've given so far at 70, because I don't know, the team just didn't work. But personally, I think this game needs many, many improvements for the future. Going to be talking about that in another video. It's going to be a bit of a rant video, I suppose. Might do that pretty soon. But nevertheless, it's been Woodmark Malvia. See you guys!